Hi, see player here. And welcome back to Assassin's Creed Valhalla. Oh, it's Gabriel. What's up, Trick? Well, you made it. And it seems you washed. Both admirable qualities in the husband. I try to hold myself to some kind of standard. <laughs> the trick is to let it slip, little by little, as the years go by. Is this truly your advice on how to begin a marriage? No, my friend. It's advice on how to end one. Damn. <laughs> when the threads get tangled like that, you need to take a walk to cool your head. One small move and you'll need to cut the whole cloth free. Easy to say, harder to do. I swear. Some days the shuttle has a mind of its own. Those are the days you most need to rest. Come back with a clear head and you'll find the shuttle is more agreeable as well. What's up, brother, Yulri? Father El. Trig brought me to one of those Christian gatherings last week. I didn't understand a word of it, but your conviction was riveting. You honor me, Thorstein. Praise from the merchant with a silver tongue speaks volumes to my success in communicating God's glory. It's a task you are most well suited for. I try, my son. What a vision stands before me! But of course, my wife had an excellent canvas to work with. <laughs> Ever the flatterer, Thorstein. Don't you know I'm soon to be a married woman? Which is why I must get all of my compliments in now, before you turn as haggard as Gunhilda. <laughs> One of these days, she won't forgive you for these jests. Then on that day, I hope the gods themselves will intervene. Brothers and sisters, we are gathered here today to witness a merging of the traditions of Northumbria and Norway, as Trigg and Edith begin their new life together. Here, where Edith's mother and father are buried, may they give their blessing to this holy union as they watch from within the Lord's sight. Love is patient and kind. It is not boastful or proud. It always protects always trusts, always hopes, always perseveres. Love never fails. Trig, do you take Edith to be your wife here in the sight of our Lord and Savior, Jesus Christ? I do. Edith, do you take Trig to be your husband with almighty God and your parents' souls as witness? I do. Then let no man separate what God has joined together. For yours is the kingdom and the power and the glory forever. Amen. May Freya bless you with many children, and Thor protect you from life's storms. Thank you, my friends. Nice. I'm so happy for them. Oh, With any luck, their marriage will be as long and prosperous as ours. I don't know about that. There's a new baker in Coppergate who's quite caught my eye. Then I suppose I'd best learn to bake. <laughs> <laughs> Not Bjorn. I think he's pissed now. Thorstein! I've been looking everywhere. I said you would vouch for me, but they want the gold now. Slow down, Bjorn. We'll talk to them together. I fear they want to do more than talk, brother. My husband and I are on our way home. This won't take long, I promise. Keep that delicious stew of yours by the fire, and I'll be back before you can lay out the bowls. If you don't have him home before moonrise, I will come and find you. You won't like what happens after that. Please, Thorstein, quickly! Keep the hearth warm for me, my love. Oh no. Quetas that his hal ye thum, a where a ye held at me and stane. 
Ach, je nu me soch plech hat den Ravrogan. Björn killed killer Thrusty. Bruh. I knew something fishy. You coddle him, my love. He's a grown man, not an errant child. Slaves talk, Gunilda. If he returns to his family and says we mistreated him, I might find myself in a duel. No duels until you've worked on your swordsmanship. Bruh. Damn. Where are you? Not here. <laughs> Bruh. Thorstein? Thorstein, wait! Where? There. Where are you? Let me help you! Damn. I knew Ubisoft obviously wanted to make so, such a beautiful wedding. Not to this. Always something, huh? Poor. Poor her. Damn. Poor Gunhilda. How are you so quick to forget? I don't trust him. And Gunhilda was right. But hey, when it crosses his side, we are in the house of I can't remember. Ow. You! Come over here! Don't be shy! Where did you come from, Thor? Where am I? Jotunheim, land of the giants. Loki thought it would be fun to play a trick on you humans. I need a word with him. <laughs> Feisty! Don't waste the time. Loki's always up to no good. He probably did it so I wouldn't notice him stealing my stuff. And the scoundrel was right. This must be a dream. Nope. Come on, Thor. Ah, I wish it was. Then I wouldn't be stuck cleaning up Loki's messes anymore. Come. Hold on. Loki, Jotunheim. Are you supposed to be Thor, the giant slayer? What do you mean, supposed to be? I am Thor. I'll have to take your word for it. My mind feels like someone's poked holes in it. Uh, do not worry about that. We will have to restore your memory to find out where you belong anyway. But first, you must help me. What could I possibly do that the god of the people cannot? 
I need you to find my gauntlets and belt. Without them, I cannot use my hammer. And without my hammer, I would not last long in a village full of giants. So I need you to handle it. Once you get my things, I will take you to the well of Mimir. Easy. For you? You will not be harmed. God's honor. But I will be waiting for you here. Just in case. Thank you. I will get the stuff. Let's go. Gotta climb up this I'm gonna take. I really want to burn. Okay, gonna read off the cam. Ow. Macy. You can read it, then pause the video if you want. You can pause the video if you want. I'm gonna read off again. Nice. Interesting. Okay, these guys are really creepy. It's like, yeah, I think I need a bi bigger axe. <laughs> Damn. I think this look much better. Not so scary, though. Was it ever creep me out? <laughs> Are you lost, human? I'm always lost. Have I checked the attic? And why is it blue then? It's blue eyes too. <laughs> it's quite a lot. So you don't know, notice them when you're not in first person. Oh, that's better. We must serve the god in order to get the cool stuff. Maybe. I forgot. We cannot destroy anything here. Oi! Boink. Sorry. Even more sorry. Wee. Wee. And no. Okay. Texture glitch, I guess. This barrel seemed refreshing, and a great place to hide something. Of course. Even more taxi in a second. That's interesting. So, Norse people with poetic gifts were said to have tasted this magical mead. Seen here, but in a drinking horn in Assassin's, Assassin's Creed Valhalla. So, that's... Why the middle come from and poetic poetry. Nice, you can pause the video if you want. You know what to read it. Let's have an adventure. Huh? Let's have an adventure to bath. Wee! Now we have bath mid nice. Alright, see you in a second. Okie dokie. Well, I'm gonna end this video. Thank you so much for watching and see you play out. Ow.